we have quite a bit of data from history which tells us what is that uh, food product that is likely to have a contaminant, which is that country that is likely to export a product that is likely to be contaminated. And that data becomes very useful for your decision making, for your food sampling requirements, uh, to decide whether that food has to be checked more than uh, you know, uh, something else. And we also have green channels where in certain products and certain countries can export products much more uh, faster or we can expedite the process of inspection. And that, that kind of helps us to uh, facilitate trade and, and not compromise on food safety as well.